Hi there, Nick Zoom here, and I'm um, just making a short tutorial video on how to get uh, installers or you know, drivers, different software programs for your computer, particularly if you've just bought a new computer. Uh, come along here to this site here called 99, and I've selected um, some programs that I would normally have on my computer that I use regularly. Uh, these days, when you get a new computer, it doesn't come with much software at all and um, you're going to need to get some software in order for you to have a good user experience so the place to to get more where i get my programs from is uh, the nine night site and uh, i would recommend you get uh, all the browsers um, they're important I've, I've recently had a situation where um, i've got some sort of uh, bug in uh, one of my browsers and it started infecting my computer but i had the other ones to be able to go on online and, and um, you know, solve my issues. So it's good to have multiple browsers. I'd certainly get all of them. Um, then, you know, compression, when you're going to compress files and send them. Um, they're all pretty self-explanatory. It's all nicely lay, laid out. Um, I'm not going to go through all the different programs, and it's probably a good idea if you wanted to click and find out what each of them does. Um, I've selected ones that I'd normally have that come up there in green, and, yeah, you know, you can certainly go through and um, look at all the different programs that are here. There's a great selection of them. Um, the important thing is that you know these days when you buy a computer, it doesn't come with very much software at all. So you're going to need to do this, and uh, you might also need to update your drivers. Or sometimes, you know, if a program is corrupted, you might want to you know delete it and then reinstall it. So, you know, for many reasons, I come back here to this site to get my programs, uh, my installers or drivers, as they used to call. Them. And um, I've also picked up some great software that I didn't, you know, wasn't really aware of. So it's a good place to even, you know, learn. Uh, Open Office is uh, something I'm using a lot more uh, regularly now. It's got some good um, templates for presentations, and um, it's quite easy to use. And over here we've got um, storage as well, like Dropbox and uh, Google Drive which is great if you want to you know, share files or you've got big files that you can't email and so forth or you're working on a project. So you'll find some great things here on this uh, site, 99, and um, it installs everything for you without giving you unwanted add-ons, uh, which you will get from some sites, and it will save you time and they're always up to date as well. So hopefully that's a good tip and I'll see you on the next video and uh, hope you enjoy 99.